fear of death how to overcome fear of death hi guys my name is Lena Semenek and this is psychology of happiness where happiness is the purpose of life today's question I received on my Russian YouTube channel the guy shared his tragic and painful experience with me uh, one of his family members died in front of his eyes and it was extremely painful for him uh, now everything is okay but since that um, time he is stuck in negative thoughts he's afraid what if another close friends or family member will die and he uh, will have to deal with those painful uh, tragic feelings again so he's asking me how to overcome fear of death so let's start fear of death is one of the existential fears existential means that uh, this fear is known through experience rather than theory of course we all know that uh, one day we die and we know that our close family members will die but uh, in reality we are ignoring those thoughts and we're ignoring those feelings because uh, unless we see how someone dies in front of our eyes we're not gonna face that fear so we know that people die from disease we know that people die from drugs but we're still avoiding those feelings and we kind of pretending that it's not going to happen to us because it's easy not to think about it it's easy not to feel the fear that comes with all those thoughts so uh, the first time in life usually people experience fear of death is in a childhood so when a close family member like grandmother grandfather dies a child does not know what to do so for example the grandmother was visiting family every weekend or maybe it's a neighbor who was very close to the family and the child used to play with him a lot so when uh, this person disappears child does not know what's happening but a child feels a lot of pain inside and in most cases adults they don't know how to deal with those feelings themselves so they cannot really help a child and these feelings are getting stuck somewhere deep inside the child the second time when a person experiences fear of death is uh, when his father or mother dies so some other significant other usually it happened when the person became an adult already and at that point those negative tragical feelings they're getting on top of the feelings that we got when we were a child when we first time experienced them so it's like one fear of death above the other fear of death and the defensive mechanism usually looks like that the person start exercising a lot uh, change your diet, um, go to church more often, maybe do some meditation or spiritual practice. This is a defense mechanism because it's like I will exercise, I will take care of my body, I will pray God and I will be protected from death. Uh, it's like we're delaying the death and in this case uh, the person is kind of trying to get control of his life and be above the death the third time when we experience fear of death and this is the strongest time is when we're afraid for our own life uh, it might be when a person is going for a serious surgery procedure or maybe um, the person has a disease and the chance of survival is small a reaction can be different one person might ignore it and if it's for example cancer the person might ignore his conditions and not go for any treatment another uh, reaction is when the person is trying to find like thousands of second opinions and he's looking for that doctor who is gonna tell him that you are okay there is no cancer in your body uh, another reaction might be if the person is looking for alternative medicine and hoping that some wood master or some spiritual master will heal him or her uh, also the person might start uh, changing his lifestyle diet exercise and thinking that if I will change my lifestyle my body will react my body will change and I will eliminate the disease myself 
Um, also, the person might start drinking, smoking, using drugs, saying like, I'm above the death. This is my body. I'm in control and I will decide what's good and what's bad for my body. So it's like I'm above the death. I will enjoy the life to its fullest and I will decide uh, you know, how much drugs I can use. So the fear of death is one of the hardest and painful fears. And to answer the question how to overcome fear of death, my answer is go to a therapist. Because uh, in a lot of situations, our friends, relatives, co-workers, partners, they don't know how to deal with fear of death. So they cannot help you with that. They cannot give you support. They cannot um, help you to accept your fears and deal with them. Usually five to six sessions is enough to talk to your therapist about that fear, accept it and somehow overcome it. So my advice is go find the therapist and work with a professional person. Fears are stopping us from achieving things that we want, career in our life, creating healthy, happy relationship, from being happy. So. Uh, if you have uh, fear, it's very important to overcome your fears so you can move on with your life. Uh, I already have a separate video how to overcome anxieties and fears and also fears in relationship for men and women. I will leave the links below this video. Please share your comments. Tell me what's your biggest fear. How do you overcome fears and anxieties in your life? Uh, share this video with your friends. Post it on your Facebook, Twitter subscribe to my channel, click the bell icon so you're not gonna miss new videos that I release every week. And thank you for watching Psychology of Happiness, where happiness is the purpose of life.